Hey guys, this is Jess with another iPhone app review. Today I will be reviewing Blingo. With Siri out there, people who are not on the 4S are trying to figure out if there's another alternative to Siri. Blingo is similar and it's currently free in the iTunes store and it picks up the um, phrases that you say pretty well actually. Um, you can search various different um, search engines with it and it's just press and speak. You can send texts with it, send email, search maps, and updates um, Facebook or Twitter. You can also call. Um, so you just click the press and speak when you're ready and you talk into the lingo. And when you're done you click it again and it will start thinking and sometimes it misses and it doesn't pick up what you say but it's fairly reliable actually in picking up whatever you want to tell it like I just told it to add a social update that said I like lingo and as you can see it's pretty accurate you can um, change which social site you want it to send to and uh, if you tap in the middle you can actually um, see different examples of what you can say if you click the apps button you can directly go into the various lingo apps well not really apps but it's connected to separate apps so you can um, change the various different settings of the apps that it uses. Um, here is the main settings for Lingo. You can turn off and on the profanity filtering, the tone that it makes when it um, checks your voice, the auto listen for when you first open the app it listens, um, your end of point detection and you can change the default search engine it has Yahoo, Google, and Bing change your auto dialing preferences if you don't want it to go ahead and dial for you then um, you can untoggle that again you can add your social sites you'll need to add your social site if you want to update a social status that's my Twitter if you want to follow me. Um, you can also add a signature onto any of your text messages. You'll have to enable it before you can actually use that. Um, and in email, all you have is um, a signature as well. Um, up here you can actually see um, that you can have Bluetooth input as well. And the languages, right now it only has um, US English and UK English. And so I'll try to say something to Vlingo one more time to give you another example. Um, here we go. So I just looked up Blingo instructions. Um, it's pretty good if you be careful of how you say words, then um, it'll pick up what you say fairly well. Um, I'm not. I'm on a iPhone four, so obviously I don't really know how well Siri picks up, but I hear it's not too accurate. Blingo is not the best, but you do get a taste of similar Siri functions. So I'm showing you right now the various different things that you can say into Vlingo so it can actually understand what you want it to do. And so 
that's pretty much it for Vlingo. Let me know what you think about this app in the comments below. And if you have any questions or concerns, you can also leave me a comment.